Hey, hey, welcome to my channel. I hope you are doing well. This is the first video of a two-part series about how I texture eyes for 3D characters. You can look over my shoulder how I create the sclera, the eye white from scratch. I often develop my own resources to make this creation process fast, easy and above all fun. And this time I made a Photoshop brush set with 36 different brushes. They consist of backgrounds and vein brushes. And even though I call them Sclera brushes, they are useful for other paint projects as well, like uh, general skin uh, backgrounds or grungy postwork. Without any further ado, I'm going to jump into the time lapse and show you what my method is to paint eye whites. I always use the wireframe of the UV map as a guide and I positioned a temporary iris shape inside to see where the sclera actually lives. As you can see, the second resource I have created for this project is a Sclera swatch palette for Photoshop. The color swatches are extracted from eye white images, so they have a wide range of light colors and also red colors to paint veins. With any skin I paint, I always block in a cloudy base color. For normal skin, I start with blue. And for this eye white texture, I use red as a base. I use the background eye white brushes which have a random angle built in and a slight color variation in each stamp or stroke. And once the red covers the entire texture, I will start making fluffy clouds in light pastel colors, building up several layers. If you see my brush opacity magically change value, it is very easy with the number shortcuts. The tree key gives an opacity of 30%. The 5 key makes the opacity of the brush 50%. And the 0 key gives an opacity of 100%. And so on. I also included vein brushes, some singles and some radial vein brushes, also with rotation variations. I like to paint the veins on separate layers and you can add new layers fast with the shortcut Ctrl J. Because the brushes automatically give angle and color variations, the texture is very easy to create. Some vein layers I apply a Gaussian blur to, to build up more depth. And the topmost layers will have the unblurred veins, so the sharp veins.
I vary in the use of brushes and colors and paint my way from the bottom to the top layer. And once the color texture is done, I set the wire guide to invisible and I select all layers, group them in the folder called color. I then duplicate that folder, rename it to bump and add adjustment layers to desaturate and level. Next, to all the separate vein layers, I add a white layer style. So they will stand out on the bump map. And with this method, you can paint an eye white texture in 20 minutes or so. Part 2 of this eye texture series will be about painting the iris. And if you would like to be notified as soon as the iris video is up, subscribe and ring that bell. And if you would like to download the brush set and swatch file, you can become my patron on patreon.com slash biscuits3d. Make it a great day. And thank you for watching.